I'm a record producer and a musician. Worked with the Black Keys, J.D. McPherson, Oak Ridge Boys, two Charlie Crockett records. Those are really fun records. And it was tape for many, many years. We're buying tape from used places, you, you know, like movie houses and stuff like that. And uh, it had a, there was a finite amount of it. And when we started to really run out, I was kind of panicking. These are the machines that I had been doing everything on up until there was no more tape. That's when I went to Radar, my first digital machine. I was doing everything exactly like I had been doing on tape. This is the machine that I did the Black Keys Brothers on, and uh, it still works perfectly. And this is the donor for the new cards that I put in the new converter box. The remarkable thing about the radar uh, cards and the system in general is, is that like a well-aligned analog tape machine, the mono single track compared to the input of the console is holographic, it's 3D. That's my criteria for, for quality sound. When I solo kick drum, I wanted to sound like it did out in the room. When I solo bass guitar or upright bass, I wanted to sound like how I mic'd it out there. When I solo piano, I wanted to sound just like what I intended and what I was hearing in the room when I mic'd it. I do mix in the box occasionally. When I do, I use my buddy Lee Dias next door, the studio next door to me. When it comes to, you know, the repeatability, redundancy of mixing, where people just want, you know, tambourine to be down or up, you know, one dB or some crazy thing like that, it's, it's best to mix in the box. Doing it on the console is kind of like painting. You, just, you do it, and if you have to do it again, it's never gonna be exactly the same. So yes, I do mix in the box. No, I don't use uh, too much of the plugins. You do use FabFilter, and I like it. Lee had uh, bought that, and I was very impressed by it. I really liked that. I commit so much to the session that once we mix, a lot of the sounds are just baked in. They're ready to go. I just also want to say thanks to all of the clients that have put up with my antique ways of working. And, uh, and I just wanted you to know that just because I have a DAW does not mean that I'm going to make sick loops for you. <laughs> <laughs>